Hi guys, welcome back to Cockfly videos. Again, we're back with another uh, challenging but not impossible integral. So sometimes looks can be deceiving because when you look at this integral, it looks pretty simple, cute, but it is actually a very hard integral. It actually requires a lot of um, different multiple techniques to arrive at the correct answer. All right, so let's get started. So normally whenever i see uh, you know integral with the uh, integrant involving um like radical expression so what i would do is actually very simple so i'm setting the entire i'm setting the entire integrant equal to u okay so basically let's get started so if i set u equal to square root of tangent x all right and also if i square both sides what i'm going to get is u squared is equal to tangent x then i'm then I would like to, like, since we have dx in the end, in the integral, so basically, in order to get dx, I need to get x. So basically, I would like to uh, take the arctangent of both sides. So when I take the arctangent of both sides, what I'm going to get is right here. So arctangent u squared is going to be equal to just x right here. So now I'm going to differentiate both sides. So when I differentiate both sides, here's what I'm going to get. So if we uh, apply the formula for arctangent, for the derivative of arctangent u squared, so it's going to be equal to uh, the derivative of inside function, which is 2 times u, divided by 1 plus u squared to the power of 2 times du equals dx. Okay, so basically, right here, this is my first replacement for the entire integral, for the original integral. And then this is my second replacement that I need to do to basically uh, turn the original integral into the integral with only one variable, which is u. Okay. Let's use back uh, the red color. So basically, if I continue and if I put things into the uh, integral, what I'm going to get right here. So we know that square root of tangent x is equal to u. So u times and dx is 2 times u du divided by 1 so, excuse my handwriting it's not best but uh, u times 2 times u du over 1 plus u to the power of 4 okay so this is my new integral so let's try to put it in a nicer way so 2u squared du over 1 plus u to the power of 4 all right, so we ended up with this integral. So let's see what we're going to do. So we can break this uh, entire integral into two integrals. Here's what I'm going to show you. So since we have u squared on top, so basically I can get used to u squared in a lot of ways. So one way is adding two, adding u squared plus 1 and u squared minus 1. So in this case, 1 and negative 1 are going to cancel each other out, and what we're going to end up with is just 2u squared. So basically, u squared plus 1 over 1 plus u to the power of 4 du plus u squared minus 1 over 1 plus u to the power of 4 du. Okay, so you see that I broke the entire integral into two pieces. So now I'm going to call the first integral integral a. The second integral, I'm going to call it integral b. So, let's first focus on the integral a. So, what, what can we do about integral a? So, how do we do? So, we got u squared plus 1 divided by 1 plus u to the power of 4. So, in this case, if I... So, for integral a, I'm going to do another substitution that is going to be very helpful. So, here's my substitution. So if I do the substitution, v equals u minus 1 over u. So basically, this totally uh, may look irrelevant to you, so why we ended up with this uh, substitution. But as long as we continue solving this problem, you're going to understand better. So why is it so helpful to use this uh, substitution? So if I differentiate both sides, what I'm going to get is dv equals u squared plus 1 over uh, u squared, as you can see. All right. Then if I if I uh, square the, the original substitution, what I'm going to get is v squared is going to be equal to u squared minus u times 1 over u times 2 
and plus 1 over u squared. So basically, here it's going to be equal to v squared is equal to u squared plus 1 over u squared minus 2. Okay, so for u squared plus 1 over u squared, I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to add 2. So basically, u squared plus 1 over u squared is going to be equal to uh, v squared plus 2. Okay. So now you may ask this question, where we can use this v squared plus 2 or u squared plus 1 over u squared. So I'm going to show it to you really quick. So if I if I clean up this part. So basically, in the integral a, I'm going to divide everything by u squared. So integral a. If I divide everything by u squared, here's what I'm going to get. So u squared divided by u squared is 1 plus u squared divided by 1 over u squared plus u to the power of 2. So notice that. So uh, I differentiated the original substitution. I got dv equals u squared plus uh, u squared plus 1 over u squared du, which is the top expression. Okay. And also for the bottom, for 1 over u squared plus u squared, I'm going to switch it with v squared plus 2. Okay, so let me clean up this part. So that integral is going to become du over v squared plus 2. Actually, dv actually. Okay, so actually this integral reminds me of this integral form. Integral dx over a squared plus x squared and which is equal to 1 over a times arctangent x over a plus c. Mine, remember that? So then this integral is going to be equal to um, 1 over square root of 2 times arctangent arctangent uh, v over square root of 2 plus c. Okay, that's the first integral. But we need to do two replacements to get the actual uh, integral of a involving the x variable because we know that u was equal to uh, v v was equal to u minus 1 over u remember that so that this integral will become 1 over square root of 2 times arctangent actually let me rewrite it so 1 over square root of 2 times arctangent for v, I'm going to put u minus 1 over u. So u minus 1 over u divided by square root of 2 and plus c. And remember that u was equal to tangent x. So if I if I change all the u, uh, u's with a tangent and square root of tangent x, so my first integral a is going to be equal to 1 over square root of 2 times arctangent uh, square root of tangent x minus... 1 over square root of tangent x divided by square root of 2 and plus c. Okay, so that's the first part of the entire integral, which is integral a. Okay, for second integral, again, we're going to divide the second integral every piece of the, uh, every bit of the uh, terms by u squared. So I'm going to divide everything by u squared. So we're going to get uh, u squared divided by u squared will be 1 minus 1 over u squared divided by 1 over u squared plus just u squared du. Okay, so for integral b, this is uh, the substitution that I'm going to do u plus 1 over u. u plus 1 over u. Again, it may look pretty irrelevant to you, but like in, like in integral a, so the substitution we use for integral a came handy a lot. So basically, uh, if I square both sides, I'm going to get uh, v squared is equal to uh, u squared plus 1 over u squared plus 2 times u times 1 over u. Okay. In this case, v squared minus 2, it's going to be equal to u squared plus 1 over u squared. So I'm going to be using this one. And also let's differentiate both sides. So we get dv equals uh, u, actually, let me go really quick. So if I differentiate v, I'm going to get dv equals 1 minus 1 over u squared du, okay, which is the top expression in integral a. So basically, integral a is going to become, so for 1 minus 1 over u squared, I'm going to switch it with dv, so dv over 
Uh, for the bottom expression, 1 over u squared plus u squared, I'm going to switch it with v squared minus 2. So the v squared minus 2. So which reminds me of this integral, um, integral dx over x squared minus a squared. This result is going to be, this uh, integral is going to be equal to 1 over 2a times natural log of x minus a over x plus a plus c. So we're going to be applying this. So equals equals so 1 over uh, 2 times square root of 2 over natural log of x my uh, v minus square root of 2 over v plus square root of 2 and plus c. Again we're going to do uh, so we, we need to switch v variable with u variable so remember that and also remember that v was equal to u plus 1 over u so in this case 1 over 2 square root of 2 times natural log uh, 1 plus 1 over u minus square root of 2 over 1 uh, plus 1 over u plus square root of 2 and plus c okay so um, then I'm going to switch u variable with uh, u variable with x remember that so remember that u was equal to square root of tangent x Okay, so basically, if whenever I see u, I'm going to switch it with square root of tangent x. So integral uh, b is going to be equal to 1 over 2 square root of 2 times natural log uh, square root of tangent x plus 1 over square root of tangent x minus square root of 2 divided by uh, square root of tangent x plus 1 over square root of tangent x plus square root of 2 and plus c. So that's the integral b. Okay, so now we're going to put uh, integral a and integral b together to finally arrive at the correct answer. So I'm going to write it down. I'm afraid I'm going to erase b. So and a. So let me put the uh, answers all together for uh, integral a and integral b. So remember that uh, integral a was equal to, so I'm going to write it down, so right here, so 1 half, uh, 1 over square root of 2 times arctangent, arctangent, uh, square root of tangent x minus 1 over square root of tangent x, okay, that's the integral a, and plus the integral b, which is uh, square root of 2 over 4 times natural log of square root of tangent x plus 1 over square root of tangent x minus square root of 2 over square root of tangent x plus 1 over square root of tangent x and plus square root of 2. Of course, under the uh, absolute value and plus c. So this is the answer for this cute simple looking integral but is actually as you can see that throughout the video it required a lot of techniques and substitutions that we needed to use all right guys thanks so much thanks so much for watching this video please uh, please stay tuned for the uh, other uh, challenging integral problems see you in the next video also you can uh, put your challenging integrals in the comment section for me to solve it in the next video bye, -bye.